Hi everyone, my name is Mehmet. I'm a mathematics teacher and a YouTuber. You can find my YouTube channel link in the description below. I've been using graphics tablets for almost six years in my online lectures. And today I'm going to show you guys how you can use XP Pen Deco 01 version 2 to teach online. I chose XP Pen Deco 01 version 2 because I believe this is the best budget graphics tablets on the market right now. It is super popular, very slim, pretty new USB-C connection, Android mode, it is great for teachers. Let me show you my setup and then I will talk about guys how I teach online with this graphics tablet. First of all, let's connect Deco01 to my computer. We need to use the USB-C cable to do that. As soon as you do, the tablet connects to your computer and you can start using. So it has a plug and play option. By the way, I am using a Windows 10 computer, but this tablet is compatible with Mac, Windows, Linux, Android and Chromebooks. The tablet is like a mouse. It works everywhere a mouse works. It has the same input method, but um, it doesn't work the same. For example, you don't need to drag the pen to reach a point. The surface of the tablet maps with the computer screen. So when you touch the middle of the tablet, the cursor directly goes to the middle. Touch the corners and it appears there. You need to use a note-taking software in order to teach online with graphics tablets. I have three of them here. You can use something like those software. Let's use the Microsoft Whiteboard first. It's very similar to OneNote. It's a very basic software. It has pens, highlighters and some other tools here. Let's write something. So, I am writing in the middle of the tablet, and it appears in the middle of the screen. Let's use another software, PDF Annotator. It has more tools, so it is better to use a software like that. It takes a few weeks to get used to the tablet. After that, you will not look at the tablet screen when you write. You see, my writings appear very natural and clear. You can also feel the pressure sensitivity, so if you press harder, your writings appear thicker. You can also insert PDF files and annotate on them, just like that. You can also annotate on Microsoft Word, PowerPoint or any other teaching material. Again, the tablet works everywhere a mouse works. There are also some buttons on the pen, and assigning them will help you access writing tools faster. To do that, you need to download XP Pen Pen Tablet software, and here it is. You can download it from xppen.com. Just change the pen button settings and then um, choose the one you want to use. So by using the side buttons, you can scroll up, down, or choose pen and eraser easily. You can also assign Tablet Express keys. To do that, you need to know the keyboard shortcuts uh, of the software you use. Here they are for PDF Annotator 8. After you find the shortcuts, go to Pen Tablet Software and then assign the Express keys you want. Let's go to the Express keys. K1 is the first button at the top and it goes like K2, K3 and so on. Choose the button, go to the function key and then write the shortcuts. And that's it. You can use the buttons after you assign them. You can also um, use it with an Android device. Used adapter comes with the tablet. I am using the USB-C adapter. And make the tablet vertical. It works just like that. And then um, use a note-taking software and start writing. I am using Google Keep to teach online with my smartphone. Great. I hope this video helped you learn how to teach online with XP Pen Deco 01 version 2. Continue watching XP Pan YouTube channel. See you next time. Goodbye.